Okay, then, boys, today we did a play review on the new Margot Le Mole. Uh, Future Stars, I hope I said that right. Let's jump into this one then. So, she is 5 foot 6 already. I don't like that. Medium high, 3 star, 4 star, right foot controlled. That's a bit better. I don't mind that first page. A little bit small. Plays in the D1 arc Emma, so, and she's French. Could be quite easy to link then. I really do think you can get quite a few uh, green chems with the men and probably some good Paris FC players out there as well. Stats. Oh, yeah, this is where it gets bad. So 84 pace. Okay, for a, that's good for a CDM. 68 shooting. Dead. 81 passing. That's okay. Do you know what? Because everything that we want on passing is good. Fine. 87 dribbling. Agility and balance is really low. We need to up that. Defending's good. I don't think there's much wrong with this. And then the physicality is a little bit low, but there's nothing wrong with this. So play styles, we've got ping pass, intercept, slide tackle, and then the play style plus is block plus. I don't think there's much wrong with this as well. It's just a little bit worse than the top cards. So in terms of chemistry style then, I would say dribbling and physicality. Or if you want a bit more pace, obviously go for pace, but dribbling as well is the main improvement there with the agility and balance being quite low and then she won't turn like a, a bus um price wise i would say around 50k would be worth it and she's 12 so if if you're at that level of team where you need someone like this the reason she's 12k is because most people are past it and that's understandable we are in february um but if you're at that stage this is definitely someone really cheap for you